Nick Cave. Nick Cave. No, not Nick Cave. Nick Lowe. One of the Nicks. Um, Nick Lowe didn't realize that someone had covered his song Peace, Love, and Understanding, and it wound up on the, the soundtrack of The Bodyguard, which wound up being the biggest selling soundtrack of all time at the time, maybe even still. So Nick Lowe, who was already old at this point, like my age, and um, he went out to his mailbox in his bathrobe, so the story goes, uh, at probably 1 p.m., woke up, rolled out to his mailbox, and in his mailbox was a check because his song appeared on the soundtrack for one million dollars. No idea, just opened the mailbox and there it was. So me and my friends in music, we tell that story to each other all the time. It's like a, it's like a well-worn nugget that you pull out in, in the cold drive towards Grand Rapids, which I'm shitting on right in there, so. But, um, so every once in a while you come up with a song and you're like, oh shit, that could be, you know, don't say it. And, um, so I've got this song I've been working on every November. Basically, one of my one of my best friends has a birthday in November, and I can never think of a good gift. So then I start pull it, pull this song out and go back to work on it. And so over the years, I've polished the song, gotten it to a point where I think I'm going to bring it to the old 97s as we go in to make our next news record. Yeah. We're definitely going to make the record, but probably I'll bring him this song and they'll be like, we hate money. Or whatever. <laughs> I don't know what they'll actually say, but that's probably what I'll hear, right? So, <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. It, you, you'll be able to tell why this song may check off some of the boxes, the Nick Lowe mailbox boxes. <laughs> as soon as I sing the first two words, you'll understand. <laughs> Oh, the party is on, it is clear. 